This is Frank Romano for Mohawk Make Ready. Well, this is the beginning of our little series on uh, variable data printing. Now, here's a good example of the kind of thing that gets my goat. Frank, thank you very much. Frank, comma, uh, expresscopy.com's online print and mail postcards hit the mark every time. I'm sorry, folks, it didn't hit the mark. I know my name, thank you very much. This is what I call the Frank, comma, school of variable data printing. This is not creative, this is not interesting, this is the most basic way of doing it. This is what everybody does. How can you make it interesting? Well, here's a case where Xerox made it interesting. They put out a calendar. Now, here, every pencil has my name on it. My vote, my complete name on it. It doesn't have it all the way, but it has it. Here's one that says, my plane is, up. My plane is waiting. Well, they got that wrong. I don't go near planes, if I can avoid it. Um, here's one with my name on chocolate. Now, okay, it's Frank, but it's on chocolate. Hey, that'll get my attention. Here I am on the floor of a basketball court. I don't see Kobe Bryant there. But, um, here I am on a tape measure. Fortunately, it's a narrow tape measure. <laughs> um, here I am on a carousel. Frank is a carousel. Here I am on a billiard ball. Now, okay, so there's my name. But it's done in interesting ways. And there are a number of programs that can do this nowadays. Um, up here I am on a, a letter that came that dredged up on the shore, if you will. So go beyond the Frank Thomas School of Variable Data Printing and start thinking imagery. Start thinking of building my name into something more interesting that gets my attention. This no longer gets my attention. I'm immune to this. I'm open to this. I'm interested in this. I will get involved in this. This will get a reaction. This is what you want. And this is Frank Romano for Mohawk Make Ready.